Hey buddies, it's Venom here, back broadcasting part 14 of the DLC, Fate of Atlantis to Assassin's Creed um, Odyssey. I was going to say Assassin's Creed Black Flag, man, but <laughs> we moved way past that game right now. <laughs> That's for sure. Okay, continuing directly where I last left off. So I don't know what's going on here. All, that, all, all I know is says, I think if I approach her there, I get to start the third part of the DLC, because I think it's all done now. You know, the second part of the DLC. So let's do this. Back so soon. Alethea, I know I wasn't gone long in the Animus, but I couldn't wait. I've been thinking about whether or not I should let you continue. And I have my answer, but I'm afraid you won't like it. Don't tell me I can't go into the third simulation. I'm sorry, Layla. I made a miscalculation, and I factored you in when it was a mistake to do so. I see that clearly now. It's time for you to leave Atlantis. You can't do this. Not now! I've seen Elysium and the Underworld. You can't take that away! If I'd known this reality would go the direction it did, you wouldn't have seen any of it. You're too human. Your DNA has succumbed to the corrupting nature of the staff. Listen, I know the bleeding effect is real, and accessing Demos's memory did affect me. But I've studied Isu artifacts. This is the last stage of my trials, when it's over, my DNA will be able to overcome the staff's control. Perhaps. But you won't see that through. My simulations are closed to you. Oh my god, am I supposed to do the third DLC if the game won't even allow me to do? <laughs> no, listen to reason. I'm sorry about what happened. No matter what I'm going in. Um, I'm sorry about what happened. No, listen to reason. I don't know, I'm just gonna go listen to reason, why not? Hear me out. What happened before Victoria was horrible. But how can I learn to control my impulses if I don't know more about the staff? This is about more than your lesson. I wanted creation, but you brought destruction. Only because I haven't learned everything yet. You wanted to teach me, and I still want to be taught. Give me another chance. Even if I were to let you in, your doctor is dead. If I could oh, take shit. that back, I would. But I can't, and I have to keep going. From her calculations, your body wouldn't be able to withstand the simulations. My body is fine. The staff kept Cassandra alive for thousands of years. I've got a protection guarantee. Your mind is a different story altogether. You don't have the sense to see its degradation. When you break it down, this staff heals, Alethea. I could come out of this smarter, more in control. Invincible. That's quite a leap in logic. Just let me see for myself. Please. Go. Oh my god, thank you. You won't regret this. Here we go. I'll see you inside. I don't get what this third DLC is all about. And I can actually kill someone, man. That's not the assassin way. What's wrong with <laughs> Killed in cold blood. Man, just need to get this third DLC out of the way. Then after that there, it's just two couple missions on the main storyline and that's this whole game done and dusted, man. Can't wait to finish it. And I've got the next games lined up as well. There's Blood and Truth VR and there's Resident Evil 2. <laughs> man, Resident Evil 3 inspired me to get Resident Evil 2, man. I have to get Resident Evil 2. I played the demo of that and the Resident Evil 2 game actually seems better than the Resident Evil 3. You know. Maybe with three, yes, yes, oh yeah, okay. Hmm. Then I can still need to get Kingdom Hearts, baby. And that's a long game, that is. Oh my god, there's gonna be like a thousand videos. <laughs> and why is this game taking so long to load? Look, 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 look at where the bar is. I could go downstairs, fry some eggs, with some toast, and come back up, and it would still be loading. Man, but seriously though, I can't wait to tackle this DLC. It's gonna be so awesome, I swear down. If I ever get the chance to, I mean, wow, should go to sleep by now. Man. Come on, oh my god, this is like, wow, mistaking the mic now. This is one of the longest loading screens I've ever seen. <laughs>
No, it's still loading. Oh my god. <laughs> Finally. That took forever, man. So where do I go now? I've been to Elysium, I've been to Hades. What's this third part now? That's interesting. I want to see what this is. Because you only get heaven, hell. Where's this limbo? <laughs> where the hell am I? No, oh, it's still loading. Jesus Christ. You're just doing it without this special effect. <laughs> Enough. No need to shout. This isn't your domain, brother. Hey, this has nothing left to offer you. You are never meant to stay here, nor in this you. You didn't belong in Gephalonia, and you didn't belong in Sparta. I can offer you a place you do belong. It's time you finally found it. Atlantis awaits. Anywhere is better than here. I won't forget this. No! What the hell happened to Hades? And I still don't get how I can defeat a god. That doesn't make any sense. But it's a computer game. Hey, what can you do? A 10 second cutscene. Atlantis. Nice. There's no need for that here. You're safe. I've heard that before. This place isn't like any other you've been. There's no Persephone, no Hades. Just you. Just me. The Castis Vasilevs, the grand adjudicator of all Atlantis. But to you, I am Poseidon. What I'm offering you, keeper of the stuff, is a place at my side. Join me as my trustees. I don't trust him. I don't trust him at all. I don't trust any any one of them. Some big stuff, I'll tell you that. Welcome home. Um, what is this place? This place is the real Atlantis. I mean, it's intact. I, th I thought this city was destroyed. Every seven years, our great city begins a new cycle. If judged to be imperfect. And who's the judge? Before your arrival, it was my decision alone. Now that I have you at my side, I intend for this cycle to last an eternity. If you're the Dicastis Vasilevs, you expect me to be... Dicastis, the judge. Be my hand in laying and enforcing judgment in Atlantis. Well, I must warn you that I'm not always right. I was both surprised and encouraged by your actions in the underworld. Fortunes were exchanged in response to your choices. But trust that I learned your reverence to justice is true. Hades must have told you about my staff. He didn't have to. As is the way with all heroes, your journey has become the staff of Atlantean legend. Then you know my staff is the reason I'm here. I need to learn how to master it. This land is a paradise of power for those with Isu devices. But all in good time. So you expect me to live among you? A home among gods? Gods? We are much more than the human conception of gods. Your father called us the ones who came before. But as Alithia told you, we are the issue. You know about my staff, Pythagoras, and Alithia? I'm starting to feel very watched. Your trials in both Elysium and the Underworld. No, 
Your triumphs there are known to us. My trials forced me into rebellion. They made me face the dead. My hardships make me a good Dicastis. We don't always choose our path. But in this case, your blood shows for you. You possess both DNA strands. The best of humans and Isu. I have no doubt that you are our mutual future. Okay, um, I'm up to the challenge. I'm done helping the issue. I have my weaknesses. I'm up to the challenge. Let's do this. Where do I start? Humans have five senses to understand the world around them. We have been blessed a sixth. Knowledge. Ah, no. It is not merely your vision of the ego. The essence of that sense sleeps now. But it can be awoken in Atlantis. Your stuff is more than a key. It's a bridge between who you are now and who you must become. And if I fully awaken this sixth sense, I'll have mastered the stuff? That and more. Come, let me show you. I'll get to use special powers like they can. I, I hope so. I accessed power sources in Elysium and the Underworld. They helped my knowledge, I think. But they haven't changed my senses. In Atlantis, you'll find the sources that awaken your new sense much more concentrated. Not only will your knowledge grow here, but it will thrive. You'll find three such sources once you leave this palace. You know them as Keeper's Insights. Doesn't look like anyone can get through. It's blocked to those who haven't full access to our knowledge. Find the source of that knowledge within this palace. Try to pass through once you do. Okay, issue knowledge. The issue sixth sense, also known as knowledge, uh, can be gathered by scanning various pieces of technology. Keepers inside catches issue codex. Okay. That means in the meantime, I can't get through. All right. Okay. Um. Icarus not available. I'm pretty certain I just saw Icarus in the cutscene. <laughs> Hello, Alethea? What the? What are you doing in here? You need an intervention. I couldn't stop you physically, but perhaps I can make you understand through technical means. No, I've got this. Stay out of it. Man, that woman on the outside, she's changed her attitude, that's for sure. Oh, I can't even change my items. My equipment and stuff, hold on. I'm not sure where to go. Let's go up, I think. Nope. Okay, Amy. You know what I missed though? I missed playing Assassin's Creed 2 with, with um, Ezio. Because on that one there, you get these tombs, and there's all these tomb challenges. You don't get that sort of thing on this one. I can't change my outfit yet. You don't get anything like that on this game. On the, on the ones after Ezio, anyway. That, that's for sure. It's just more action packed and story driven, but it's not so. I mean, you get the. In Origins, where you're back and stuff, you get. Uh... Hold on. You get Egyptian tombs that are in there, like Toots and Carmoon and whatever else. But the tombs, they don't really pose any challenges. No, oh, I just about made it. Uh, I think I'll go here. Strange, but it feels like the stuff is becoming a part of me. I think I'm starting to understand. It's like I can feel issue memories and hear their wisdom. Right, okay. Um, I mean, let's go and grab this fool Poseidon. <laughs> Yeah, it gave me some item, but I can't even... Oh, you know what it was? I was pressing the wrong button. <laughs> I need to change my outfits, man. Look, this one was good, but only for the underworld, though, where I'm at. When I was in Hades. Because their special abilities protect 10% max health while in Tartarus Rifts. I mean, there are no Tartarus Rifts now. Pass through the Veil of Tartarus. What's the point now? I mean, Atlantis, baby. Um, but there's no other armor that's good enough as such yet. So, well, not yet. That's for sure. Hold on a minute. 
So where do I go now? Right, let's go down here. Oh my god. Oh god, can I jump down there? No. Nope. Oh my stomach. Jesus Christ. Feeding every blow. <laughs> I need to talk to this guy. You meant about the sources being more concentrated. I feel different. Many things are different here than Castiz. You'll discover that in time. Atlantis awaits you. I have one rule that is absolute. Our technology cannot be used on my human civilians. Their bodies cannot withstand the power. The Isu know this above all. So, I'm free to go? What task should the Dicastis do first? Even Atlantis is not a perfect society. It yearns for balance. So be that balance. Then when your role as guide to the people is fulfilled, it may well be perfection. Don't worry. You've already earned my respect, which is a trial in itself. This, His Eminence Atlas humbly requests that you join him at his doma to discuss a matter of grave importance. Right. I'll make sure to stop by. Yeah, we didn't know he's on the one in charge. <laughs> How the hell is that even possible? Oh, look at that staff Eminence? of Dicatis. What does this staff do? This will be interesting. No, no, where is it? Oh, that's the one I got from Hades yesterday. Assassin damage, fire damage. Critical chance now affects elemental build-up. Right, okay. I don't know about that though. It does the assassin damage. I'm all warrior build, you know? Um, judgment of the line. Sounds beastly, but it's weak. <laughs> um, the staff I just got. Right, okay. Hold on. Uh, it's not that one. It's a gold one, isn't it? Hold on. Yeah, I mean, some of these ordinary weapons, they have better abilities than these gold ones. Warrior damage, damage with staffs. Staff damage becomes not down damage. That sounds really good. And it's more powerful as well though. Hold on, let me just compare it. The thing is though, I need to increase the power of my one. I do need to upgrade it. Um, low chance to gain 30% health. Shield. Melee charging speed, 60% more damage. I like this legend, I like this staff of darkness. But the thing is, I've already got a staff. Um... No, I don't. I have a spear. I like this spear. 10% damage per enemy. Engage up to 50%. That's good. Hold on a minute. Let me check out this one. Damage with spears. And this one is damage with staffs. You know what? I'm going to equip this one. I like it. it sounds good. Okay, so... Um... I'm not even too sure where to go. No, oh, then. Multiple quests accepted. Where do I go first? Let's find out. Okay, where's good quest? Go. Um. Meet Atlas as his doma. Okay, I need to do the Keeper's Insight just as before with the other DLC ones. Um, reach Knowledge Sequence 1. I let me just, where is that on the map? Okay, this place doesn't even have any segments, it's just one big map. Okay. Oh yeah, already there's a little side mission, there's... Burden of Leadership. Yeah, okay, where is that one? That seems like it's down there. Hold on. And where is the... 
Hold on a second. Where is... How do I get to... Um... I'm trying to get to the synchronization point. Palace of Poseidon. I think you climb up. But I have no idea. Yeah, uh, yes, yeah, it's going down. Wow. I can't wait to do that diving thing off here. That'd be so dope. It's gonna be so hot. Hey, look, there's Icarus. How you doing, buddy? Climb from here. <laughs> Trust me. Right, so. Right, the middle one. Um, just trying to figure out how to get the Banca Sandra. Jesus Christ, woman. Oh, that minute. Wow, this is the only synchronization point I'm going to in this place, man, because it's so... Wow, wow, it's even distorting the camera angles. Well, just to get to the synchronization point. Jesus Christ. Look how much there is to climb, man. I've been at this for a good two minutes already. Oh, no, so I can't go over that. Um, right, I should be able to go here. Reminds me of abseiling. Right, getting closer now. To the point of interest, baby. doing that again trust me man hold on where's the next where's where's the actual <coughs> where's the mission okay the mission is hold on a minute um like this one here so where is it on the map right it's over there right okay so it's down there let's do this About a good 10 seconds to reach the wall. Don't want to go through there. That takes me back to Greece. Don't want to do that. And hey, look at him. Just sitting down in his gigantic throne doing fuck all. <laughs> okay. So where is this, um... Mission? Whoa. Jesus. From that high in this body of water, she should be dead. Um, let me swim back up. I swear there was fish and there's jellyfish in here. <laughs> oh, then. Um, I think I saw something over here. Nope. Okay, where's the main mission? Where do I go? She can't even sprint in this thing. How terrible. Now, looking around for some shit, you know? coming to see me. I'm sure you're very busy. The burden my father gave you is not a light one. I'm happy to help. Your messenger told me it was urgent. Gravely urgent, indeed. Well, here I am. It's my brothers, the Archons. They have issues with the human populations under their control. Tensions between Isu and humans are mounting. Without order, the problems will grow severe. I'll try and use my position to help them where I can. Find Hadiros, Amphilis, and Azeas. 
Through your shining example, I hope they learn the valuable lessons in discipline they so desperately need. And if I help them, you're hoping it'll maintain the peace between Isu and humans. That's the plan. Poseidon should have known they weren't ready for the responsibility an Archon bears. But that's his failing. I have what I need. The Archons and make sure their problems are taken care of. Yeah, they're going to be highlighted on the map. <laughs> what is it? What did he point to? I don't quite... What? Did he point in here? What the hell is in here? Because he looked across in here, then it was the end of the cutscene, so... Wow, hold on. Whoa. What is this? Am I underwater? I am. Look, look, look at that. Is that. Oh no, it's just some leaves. I thought there were seahorses. <laughs> I was like, shit. Let me dive in here. Oh, I can't even dive in here. What? I thought that I could. So, where's the. Where the hell's the mission? Find and talk to that guy. Okay, where is he? He's way over there. Jesus Christ. Oh, damn it. I'm liking this room, though. This Atlantis is proper sick. It's like each DLC, the feeling you get when you play is better. It, it feels... You know, it feels good. The trouble with this... Hold on a minute. Where's my horse? Hold on. I'm just trying to see how long it can take to get over there because... In the previous two DLCs, man, you gotta like, do a lot of... Do a lot of, um... Climbing. Oh no, it's over there. Not too far away, so... Um, new region discovered poor we must bring something like that let me just check Let's go. oh my god I'm sorry horsey I'm so sorry I know you're gonna die but you'll come back <laughs> you always do <laughs> horsey no No, no. Man, these people are just standing there in silence, doing nothing at all. Oh, no, where's the... Oh, there it is. Target is close. And we just... Where's the target? Where's the target? Find an icon. No, no, I'm probably gonna have to do a couple of missions as well. Just to get him to talk to me and stuff like that. Hold on, can I go in here to get to him? Nope. Hold on, what's around here? Is this trespassing if I go up here? No, it's not. No, at the moment, anyway. He's probably gonna say, you have to do this mission, this mission, this mission, then I'll help you. <laughs> As always. No, oh, guy's drunk. <laughs> I was beginning to lose all hope. Atlas said you needed help. You don't understand the responsibility on my shoulders. It's my job to concoct entertainment for the masses. But I fear the crowd have grown bored of my grand spectacles. I've seen some good plays. And some bad ones. We need more than a simple play. If the audience leave my shows bored and restless, who knows what they'll start plotting. Do you think they'll become violent? My purpose is to keep them preoccupied so they can't be violent. Okay, you need to be more creative. Distractions don't solve it. You need to be if more creative. shows have become boring, you just need to get more creative. Oh, 
The humans are primitive. Their tastes basic. They like life simpler joys. Blood, tragedy, Romans, that sort of thing. So give the people what they want. What they want. Yes. Good, good customer service. <laughs> I can hear the tears now! The legendary Dicastis Cassandra takes on Atlantis' finest warriors! You must take part in my next event! Sounds like a Bangration. I can definitely help with that. Not exactly. But I was inspired by your efforts in Elise. I know you'll do an exemplary job entertaining the crowds as you did then. If we pull this off, We'll be the talk of the city. It's worth a try. So what do I do now? What the hell is going on here? I'm getting ready to do a mission. And the thing isn't even giving me a mission to do. There's no action. There's no... Okay, all I've done is get to place. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. Wow, this fast... This staff is quick, man. I'll tell you that. Hold on a minute. Oh shit. Bruh. Bruh, I need my health, hold on. I need to use my health. I'm gonna die. Nice. Hold on a minute. I don't seem to have them. Um. Yes. Hopefully, I get four adrenaline bars. Oh shit. Man, whoever this guy is, he's tough, man. No well done. Keep dodging these fools. Right, two dead, two to go. I like this staff though, this staff is rough, it's so quick. You miss me. You miss me again. But like that, yeah. Sweet. Yeah, this staff is super quick, man. I like it. I like it a lot. Hold on, this guy's got bear moves. No, no. There we go. This is definitely not a Pangration. Mission over. Is that it? There were a whole bunch of weaklings. Our hero's next talents fast approaches. A champion bested by none in the city. No mercy, no guilt. Will this be too much for even the Dicassis to overcome? Alright, bring it. <laughs> Dodge him already. <laughs> This. <laughs> See, this guy is the area boss. This guy is so tough.
Come on. You know what? I'm just gonna cheese him. Where did he go? Come on. Man, I like this stuff, man. It's so quick, man. I swear to God. Check that out. This is well quick, man. It's as quick as a sword. Nice, dust him. No, I didn't even touch him. No. Oh. That's the thing, is he? These guys aren't that tough. It's just that they got bare health. They got just lots and lots of it, man. Now this staff is sick, man. Might keep this and this spear to the end of the game now. Now, what does that one do? I don't know that. Miss. Nice. Just trying to work out which item does the most damage with the overpower map. I'll tell you that. Hold on. Whoa, you almost killed me, Jesus. Oh, nice. You're dead, baby. Killed by the venom. The champion has been bested. Our mighty Dicastis is victorious and the crowd have spoken. But will she show mercy or will she spill the blood we want? If you don't appease the crowd, I fear what Gadiros will do. It was an honor to fight you, Dicastis. I'll show you mercy, boy. You don't deserve to die just for losing. Our merciful Vicastis has passed judgment. But do not dismay. Our champion lives to fight another day for you, the audience. And here we are, the end of today's event. Next to face our Vicastis' judgment, the very scum that taints our city. What? What is this? For the good of Atlantis, 
today bear witness to the guilty and condemned given one final chance at redemption. They will be honored to die at the hands of our guest. Refuse, man. Enough! I am not doing this. Mm. Uh, fear not, friends. We will make sure justice is delivered. I ain't gonna fight them people. I feel sorry for them. Well, that was an unmitigated disaster. You said fight, so I fought. The problem is that I didn't say fight. I said be as entertaining as possible. The game should continue. The games must stop. This mm. will help the relations between your people. The humans will see what's going on eventually. The games have failed. The humans are restless and it's only a matter of time before they make their own entertainment. Their hunger for violence is insatiable. You just need to keep surprising them. Think like a human, not an issue. That's what I tried to do. But you showed the criminals mercy. And the crowd reacted as I expected. Killing people who can't defend themselves isn't entertainment. It's slaughter. Their sacrifice helps us keep the peace and maintain order. Or it would have if you played along. What are you saying, Radirus? That my grand experiment has failed. There's nothing left to be done but start again and try for better results. The arena must be cleared. Guys lost his marbles, man. This is madness. That's what I just said. What are they attacking me? What? Oh, then what's going on? Nope, they're taking somebody else. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. Um, it's been long enough. Cause I need to upload it to YouTube and so on. So this is the Venom signing off. Peace. Hold on. What the hell is going on down here? That's not my business. Peace.